Hey guys, welcome back. Thanks for checking out Head First Thursdays again. Yeah, I know we used to be Faze, but I changed it. Yeah, well, it's all part of identity, which is the fun little segue into this episode's topic. Hi. Hello, I am Brett Hetherington. I am the founder, creator, and only employee of Head First Studios. Thanks for checking out another episode of Head First Thursdays. And last week, I spent a little bit of time talking about identity and a little bit about my own identity and hinted at the identity for Head First Studios. And so this week, I want to continue that conversation and I thought that the, uh, the most interesting way to do that would be to walk through some of the different branding icons and the logos that Head First Studios has had. So let's dive right in. This first logo from almost two years ago, I wanted to have a really simple logo with this one. And so it's, I tried to keep it to just a word mark where it was the name Head First Studios inside of a rounded uh, rectangle there. The thought at the time was I wasn't sure what I was going to do with Head First. I knew I was going to do video production. I knew I was going to be doing some some graphic design, some website construction, uh, but I really wasn't sure where I wanted to go with the business at that time. After a little while, this word mark uh, felt kind of generic to me. I mean, I, I like it, but it just wasn't communicating what I wanted to communicate. And so I moved on to this new kind of blue gradient version of a square that I tipped on its side, kind of subverting expectations. It's a square, but it's not quite a diamond. I was hopeful that it communicated some out of the box thinking. It's got the head first name on it. It also has room for three icons that I came up with that communicate the process of creation that I had and still have. Anyway, after a while, I uh, felt it needed a little refresh, felt it might be a little too busy. So I went with a simple circle, uh, kind of encompassing an ongoing journey where the creative process is always ongoing. There, there is a clearly defined start and close for each client, but my process is ongoing. It refreshes. There's, there's always another project coming up. And so I wanted to imply that type of ongoing and longevity that I hope for Head First Studios to have. And it gave me a little bit of flexibility. I could change up some color options. I could change up some, some border. And you know, I, I did a little bit, but after a while it felt like it was too broad. And I had been encouraged to refine my focus of Head First Studios and to just focus on one aspect that I was delivering. And so I, I took that advice and I elected to focus on the video production end of Head First Studios, which gave me an opportunity to further refine, we'll say, the logo and focus solely on video production. And so I created a camera icon and I kept the circle around the camera, partially because of style, uh, I, I like how it looks, but also because at a subtle level, it continues to reinforce that idea of an ongoing creative process, where for me, it's always happening. The one problem with this logo is once I settled on it, the videography projects kind of dried up and everything I was getting at the time was graphic design. It was logos, it was images for websites, uh, it was creating whole new elements that were all graphic based. So I took another swing at it. I moved away from the blue color scheme. I went towards more of a greenish, uh, in, in large part to symbolize growth and health. And within this circle, which again, ongoing process for me, there are a bunch of little squares and each square kind of symbolizes a different type of project. Central is a 16 by nine square, which, well, really it's a rectangle, but the 16 by nine area symbolizes videos. The more film style that I love to do, documentaries, memories, weddings, and each of the other little squares and rectangles surrounding it, they all kind of symbolize different ideas of where that creative space can be. Sort of like an Instagram photo, the vertical shot of what you would shoot on a cell phone. But all of these little spaces symbolize different ways, different sizes, different shapes that the graphic and video projects that Head First 
provides can come within. It encompasses everything I want to communicate where Head First Studios offers graphic design as well as video production, and it's an ongoing process. The creative process never stops for me. Branding is important. Identity is very, I mean, it's just, it's a bedrock important item for any business or individual. And I want Head First to, to be at the forefront of this, to be an identity agency in essence, where it's not just, hey, I'll make a fun little video for you, but that video is gonna further cement your identity. I've been working a lot with a company that's a startup right now for air filtration. Everything I've done with them has helped them refine their identity. They had a good idea in place, and everything I've done is helped them solidify that in the business world and with individuals. And that's the type of service that Head for Studios is all about offering, that I care about and that I'm committed to. So that's all I've got for you this week. Check back next week as we're gonna have some more stuff. I've got a lot on the plate, a lot in the pipeline. So you keep tuning in and I will keep sharing stories. See ya. <laughs>